Hey everyone, today, we're diving into an incredible new discovery that could change the way we think about next generation electronics. Imagine if we could better understand why electronic devices degrade over time, and then use that knowledge to make them last longer and work more efficiently. Well, that's exactly what researchers at the University of Minnesota Twin Cities have done, and their findings could reshape the future of electronic memory devices. Let's get into it. Welcome to Trend Storm. Chapter 1 Next Generation Electronics Degradation Researchers have been studying how next generation electronics, including memory components found in our computers and smart devices, degrade over time. This research, which was published in ACS Nano, a peer reviewed scientific journal, takes a close look at why these devices break down and could pave the way for creating more efficient data storage solutions in the future. Chapter 2 Spintronic Technology and Its Role in Data Storage As technology advances, the demand for efficient data storage grows. One of the key innovations in this area is Spintronic Magnetic Tunnel Junctions, or MTJs. These are nanostructured devices that use the spin of electrons to enhance devices like hard drives, sensors, and Magnetic Random Access Memory, MRAM. Spintronics is an emerging field with the potential to greatly improve energy efficiency, especially in technologies like AI and in memory computing. MTJs are already being used in products like smartwatches, but there's still so much more we can learn to make them even better. Chapter 3. Observing Device Degradation in Real Time To understand exactly how these devices degrade, Researchers used a sophisticated electron microscope to observe the internal structure of MTJs in real time. They looked at nanopillars, tiny, transparent layers within the device. By running a current through these layers and gradually increasing it, they could see, in real time, how the device began to degrade and eventually fail. According to Dr. Wanwei Yun, the lead author of the study, Conducting these experiments was extremely challenging, requiring dozens of attempts before achieving consistent results. But their persistence paid off. They were able to observe a phenomenon that had only been theorized before. When too much current is applied, the layers inside the MTJs start to pinch, creating what they called a pinhole. This pinhole is an early sign of degradation and if they continued adding current, the device would eventually melt down and burn out. Chapter 4. Breakthroughs in Understanding Electronic Failure What was really surprising to the researchers was that this burnout happened at much lower temperatures than previously thought. In fact, the device failed at temperatures almost half of what was expected. Professor Andre McCoyan, one of the senior authors, explained that materials at the atomic scale behave very differently, including having different melting temperatures. This means that these tiny devices will fail under different conditions than we previously understood. This discovery is huge because it shows us that the properties of materials change drastically at such small scales and we need to rethink how we design these devices to make them more reliable and long-lasting. Chapter 5. Implications for Future Electronics Design Jian Ping Wang, another senior author and distinguished McKnight professor, mentioned that there has been a high demand for understanding how materials behave under real working conditions, like when applying current and voltage. And now, for the first time, we have achieved that level of understanding. This breakthrough will have a direct impact on the design of next-generation microelectronic devices. Think about it. If we can use this information to design more durable memory units, we could make computers, smart devices, 
and data centers far more efficient and long-lasting. This could mean fewer device failures, less e-waste, and ultimately more sustainable electronics for everyone. The work being done by the researchers at the University of Minnesota is a major leap forward for the semiconductor industry. By understanding how MTJs degrade, we can start designing electronics that don't just meet the demands of today but can keep up with the tech of tomorrow. Source University of Minnesota So what kinds of future applications do you see for these improved electronic memory devices? Let us know in the comments below. If you're excited about these advancements in spintronic technology and how they could impact everything from smartwatches to AI systems, make sure to like this video, subscribe to Trendstorm, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on our latest updates in science and technology. Thanks for tuning in, and as always, stay curious.